one man delighted to be in China was David Lipsky. Our Q School graduate has been making waves on the Asian Tour recently, but he isn't one to get carried away with his stellar rookie season, especially being in a room honoring champions. Pretty inspiring. That's the place I want to have my picture at. You know, seeing all those names up there and seeing all the pictures of the best players in the world, winning uh, some of the best tournaments in the world is uh, pretty inspirational. And that's what I hope to achieve in my career. Yeah, I mean, of course, I won earlier this year. And it definitely means something to be here and competing against them. So, so I'm really happy with uh, you know, being in this tournament, playing against all these guys. The 24-year-old, however, is already a champion in his own right, having won the ISPS Handa Faldo Cambodian Classic in March this year. What more, he did it in style, right in front of six-time major champion Sir Nick Faldo himself. And being a champion, it not only opens doors to bigger events, fame and popularity, which usually tag along as well. The range attendants and the car girls have all been uh, pretty cheerful, and uh, you know they're asking me and uh, my caddy for autographs. They, honestly, they want my my caddy's autograph more than they want mine. It was definitely surprising winning so quick. You know, won, I won my third event, but you know it's something that I thought I could do out here. I played in big events earlier this year. You know, I played uh, in Switzerland and in, in Malaysia, but this is uh, a bit of a different level. <laughs> Playing against you know a lot of the best players in the world. I mean, I, I think like four or five, six of the top ten players in the world are here, which is you know pretty amazing. So being able to play in an event and play against them and really see where my game measures up to theirs is uh, this is going to be fun this week. My goal is always to uh, get better at golf and play against the best players in the world. It's not necessarily to be on any certain certain tour. Former world number one Luke Donald, whose advice was helpful in Lipsky winning his first Asian Tour title, is not surprised by his early success. Well, I know David well. Obviously, we went to the same college uh, at Northwestern in Chicago, and uh, I played quite a bit of golf with David. It was nice to see him win an Asian Tour event earlier this year, and he's, he's making great progress in his game. And uh, it's a good opportunity for him to be here and, and playing next week in Singapore too, so I, I wish him all the best. His stats in this rookie year would make impressive reading, but to Lipsky, that wasn't the only benefit of playing in Asia. Honestly, it, it hasn't been the golf. <laughs> it's been uh, traveling throughout Asia and seeing all these new new places and experiencing different cultures. And I never got a chance to do that in school or when I was uh, younger. So being able to do that now and getting paid to do that is even more of a bonus. So. That's what I've really enjoyed out here is just meeting different people, just making new friendships and uh, seeing, seeing the world pretty much. The 24-year-old is not only enjoying the lifestyle that comes with being a professional golfer, he also relishes the challenges that come with it. I enjoy the pressure, honestly. I, I enjoy being in the spotlight. I enjoy, you know, being in contention. It's, it's what I, why I play this game. You know, I, I wouldn't play if uh, I didn't didn't enjoy it or if I was afraid. You know, I mean, obviously, I, you get, you get a, little, a little anxious sometimes being uh, in contention, but that's what I live for. I mean, that's, I love golf and I love competing. For the love of the game, Lipsky has been a professional in the truest sense, putting in the hours to improve his game and ultimately to be the best player on tour. Really worked on my short game, making making sure that was uh, cleaned up because that that's what really hurt me. I thought in the uh, spring was partly why I was a little inconsistent, and it paid off. And I played pretty well my first uh, five events. Didn't miss a cut. A couple top fives. And my goal hasn't changed it's to keep getting better and to keep playing and competing. So uh, I would probably say to maybe win the order of merit. That's what I, I really wanted to do. Uh, it just shows that you're the best player on the tour, pretty much. Well, to be the best, you've got to beat the best. And the WGC HSBC Champions Tournament would give Lipsky the perfect opportunity to do just that. I would love to play with uh, play against Luke. Definitely a big role model for me, you know, with what he's achieved so far. So playing against him and Bill Mickelson, you know, 
as I think he has the most majors here of anyone else. But that's my goal. So hopefully they're in the uh, final group because <laughs> that's where I plan on being. And we bet that Lipsky would want to go into the history books as one of those in the upper echelon of Asian Tour's best golfers. And we certainly wish David the best in following in the footsteps of his idols.